I was wondering if I could play bass guitar through this entire interview. Yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Uh. I lived in LA for one year. Okay. And uh, I had a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. I hung out with a lot of old friends. Mm -hmm. but, but, you know, ultimately, convenience is king. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, LA is an inconvenient place to live, it's an inconvenient place to work. And you should, uh, you should only move somewhere when it's, uh, when it's really advantageous to you. San Francisco is an advantageous place for me. I can, uh, I, I can work. I can, um, I can do comedy. I can uh, play uh, electric bass guitar. I, I think a lot of people would assume if you if you move to LA and you move right back, mm -hmm. uh, that well, one you think you're gonna be like an LA hater. I don't hate LA. Mm -hmm. um, I don't like. I mean, okay, I don't like the weather. Yeah. I don't necessarily like a lot of the people mostly yeah. people that were born there <laughs> I don't like the Lakers I think that I don't like that franchise yeah I don't like um, much of the comedy scene I think it's I think it focuses Black. on um, right. you know just topics that are that are inconsequential you know I, I don't I don't like uh, East LA I'm not too crazy about West LA, mm -hmm. North LA, I couldn't really care too much for. <laughs> South LA, I've never really been to. But I don't hate LA. There's just certain things I don't like about it. Mm -hmm. So I'm not an LA hater. Mm -hmm. You just don't like everything about LA? I just those few things. <laughs> and you come out here, you sit in your living room on a Saturday with no pants, and play bass guitar. Like, what's, what's wrong with that life? Nothing. That's exactly how you want life to be. You want to be able to flow like it's like you just like like water it's going from one place to the next and uh you know in LA you you know if you have to be there you're trying to struggle and shit man, yeah fuck I'm, that I'm trying to struggle <laughs> trying to be happy I like how happy I am here's the thing that most most comics or musicians or anyone I talk to now, the people where people go wrong is they're worried about the end product. All they're thinking about is what do I gotta do to get to get to this one place? And you know, that place is different for some people. Like some people they wanna be on a TV show. Some people they wanna be in in a rock band, you know, playing electric bass guitar all over the world. Some people wanna be a touring comic and they wanna to tour the world. And that's all they think. Think about that one goal, and, and then they think about what do I do to reach that goal? And they spend so much time thinking about the end, the end product, that they forget about why they were doing what they were doing to begin with. And they, they stress out over it, and they don't, um, they, get, they get real defeated when things don't go their way. When in reality, like, you have what it is you want to do. You know, like, you want to be funny, you want to be uh, an actor. You want to be the best electric bass player that's ever lived. And that should be all you think about. All you think about is, okay, I'm just going to do what I want to do, and I just want to be the best at it. All that other shit, then if you, if you come at things that way, then that stuff comes to you. Like, I was talking to a guy, he's like, what do I got to do to work at the punchline? Like, what do I have to say? What do I do this, do that? I was like, dude, just, just be funny. Like, you, you do this because you like being funny, right? Because you like to do comedy. Then just be funny. Mm -hmm. Be the funniest person that you can possibly be. And, and, then, and worry about that. Just worry about that. A few years ago, I, um, I thought uh, I wanted to start a punk rock band. And I wanted to have it all comedians. And, uh, but I didn't want it to be funny. I thought, well, we spend all day being funny. Why, um, why, why would we have a band that was funny? 
if I, if I had to go back and do it again, I would do it entirely differently. Well, well I mean, what, what was the problem with it? It should if it was the four comics, it should have been funny. It should have been it should have been funnier, you know. It shouldn't have been as entire as as, as serious as it was trying to be. Then you know, I should have not let Sal play guitar. I think, but we've we've gone over this before. I should have just let Sal sing and not touch an instrument because he can't play them. He's no good at them. He just doesn't have the. Well, we talk about vacant space. There's not a lot going on between ear to ear and Sal, and that's not his fault. That's that's life's fault <laughs> for making him not that smart of a person. <laughs> Have you listened to his podcast? It's amazing yeah. how little how little is discussed over thirty minutes. Yeah. Uh, because he's not capable of. Like, what does he say? I, I've never nothing really. To it's it's the, the argue about nothing, and then and then the the they will have arguments where they both lose the argument. It's amazing. <laughs> it's amazing. How they even accomplish it, and uh, uh, you know, but as like as a as a performer, uh-huh. as a front man, as a singer, he's he's the, I mean straight up magic, straight up magic. <laughs> yeah. And, and you know what ended up happening is we played shows to nobody. Yeah. And I kicked Sal out of the band, and um, <laughs> and then lied to him and said <laughs> I broke up the band which is really my way of kicking him out of the band and then I started in another band with the same people oh just my not god uh, let me give me one second you got a bathroom around here I'm yeah gonna sure know. we just are we gonna keep the camera rolling while you use the bathroom yeah I know well uh, no yeah, you know right. what actually no yeah keep it running <laughs> yeah okay it's right it's right down that way alright actually I'm, I'm gonna be really surprised with the uh, I love all the pictures of naked chicks in your house. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh shit! I got a little bit of magic on the on the bass guitar. Yeah. 